Subscribe to the NBA Focus channel for breaking news, we share up-to-date content on everything sports-related. Let's dive into the 2024-25 Phoenix Suns and explore whether Kevin Durant and Devin Booker can lead this remixed squad back to title contention. The Phoenix Suns made blockbuster moves, acquiring Kevin Durant and Bradley Beal with championship ambitions in mind, but last season fell far short of those expectations. Despite a strong regular season, their playoff run ended abruptly with a sweep by the Minnesota Timberwolves, a team they had dominated previously. Afterward, Devin Booker acknowledged the team's focus needed to shift from relying purely on talent to honing in on the details, which may have been a veiled critique of coach Frank Vogel's leadership. Soon after, the Suns made the decision to fire Vogel. Despite the disappointing finish, some bright spots emerged. Booker thrived in his pseudo-point guard role, improving his assist-to-turnover ratio while maintaining his scoring efficiency. Durant, who has struggled with injuries in recent years, missed only seven games, his fewest since tearing his Achilles in 2019. Joseph Nurkic, a new addition to the squad, also had one of his healthiest seasons, missing only six games. Notably, Grayson Allen posted a career year, shooting an incredible 46.1% from beyond the arc. Heading into the offseason, the Suns faced limited options for upgrading their roster but managed to make significant additions. New head coach Mike Budenholzer comes with a championship pedigree, and Phoenix hopes his attention to detail will make the difference. The Suns also bolstered their lineup with key signings, including point guards Tyus Jones and Monty Morris, along with veteran big man Mason Plumlee. The front office re-signed Royce O'Neal and Josh Okaji to team-friendly deals while adding promising young players like rookie forward Ryan Dunn and playmaking center Oso Iguodaro. If everything clicks for the Suns this season, their offense could become one of the most potent in NBA history. With Durant, Booker, and Beal all playing at elite levels, and Budenholzer implementing a system that maximizes their strengths, Phoenix could quickly emerge as a dominant contender. An improvement on defense, coupled with Budenholzer's ability to nail the details and manage rotations, could make them a force to be reckoned with. In this scenario, the Suns not only contend for the playoffs but make a deep run to the NBA Finals, with Budenholzer possibly earning his third Coach of the Year award. On the flip side, the Suns face real risks. If injuries strike, particularly to Bradley Beal, who missed significant time last season, or if the defense fails to improve, Phoenix could struggle to live up to expectations. Nurkic's health remains a question mark, and if his form dips, the Suns could find themselves in a tough spot. In the worst-case scenario, Kevin Durant trade rumors could start to swirl by midseason, and another first-round playoff exit would cement the season as a failure, pushing the franchise into turmoil. Last season, the Suns' trio of Durant, Beal, and Booker played together in only half the games. They had a solid record of 26-15 when all three were on the court but didn't demonstrate the dominance that many expected. Phoenix finished the regular season at 49-33 with a number 10 ranking in offense and number 13 in defense. Both Durant and Booker earned All-NBA honors, but those accomplishments felt hollow after their brutal loss to Minnesota. Phoenix made moves that could define its future. New coach Mike Budenholzer is expected to increase the team's three-point rate and nail down those all-important details. Tyus Jones and Monty Morris were brought in to ensure smooth operations on the floor, while veteran Mason Plumlee and rookie Ryan Dunn add depth to a second unit that also includes Royce O'Neal and Grayson Allen. While the Suns re-signed key players like O'Neal and Josh Okaji on tradable contracts, they said goodbye to some familiar faces, including Eric Gordon and Drew Eubanks. Among Suns supporters, there's growing optimism that the team filled some crucial gaps this offseason. While last year's team had offensive firepower, they lacked structure and depth. Now, with the addition of two pass-first point guards, Jones and Morris, along with a full season of Royce O'Neal, Phoenix hopes to establish a more balanced and efficient system under Budenholzer's leadership. However, there are skeptics who question whether the Suns can truly contend for a championship. While the team added some valuable pieces, the front office's decision to promise starting roles to Jones and Morris has raised eyebrows. There are concerns about the defense, particularly with Booker and Beal expected to shoulder heavy workloads on both ends of the floor. Phoenix is also banking heavily on Joseph Nurkic, a player with a history of injuries and inconsistency. Some believe that unless Nurkic can elevate his game, the Suns will remain vulnerable against the top teams in the West. One argument among Suns believers is that Phoenix's offseason was drastically underrated. The team signed valuable players for minimum contracts, and the roster has addressed its previous deficiencies. For example, Tyus Jones and Monty Morris add stability in the backcourt, while Nurkic, though not a rim protector like Brook Lopez, is a solid defender and passer who could play a key role in Budenholzer's system. 
The coaching change is also expected to bring fresh ideas, with Budenholzer utilizing more off-ball movement and less reliance on ISO plays, which could make Booker, Durant, and Beal even more dangerous. On the other hand, the skeptics argue that Phoenix's Big 3 doesn't have the same allure as other super teams, and they question whether Budenholzer can get the most out of this group. The concerns range from Beal's durability to whether the Sun's small ball lineup can hold up defensively. Phoenix might have improved on paper, but some are not convinced that these changes will translate to playoff success, especially with the added pressure of a championship or bust mindset. In summary, the Phoenix Suns enter the 2024-25 season with a roster that has more balance and depth, but questions about chemistry, defense, and health remain. Whether they rise to title contention or fall short again will depend on how well Budenholzer and his new-look sons can execute. Join the legends and be a part of your team's exclusive community by hitting the Join button. Whether you're a proud member of Lakers Nation, standing strong with Warriors Tribe, or representing the Celtics legends, there's a place for every fan. Support your favorite team, unlock special perks, and connect with fellow fans who share your passion. Don't miss your chance to be more than just a fan, become a part of history.